Hey guys, this is Art. Good morning to you. I want to show you my morning routine, which I do every morning. As I said before in the previous video that I am a diabetic. This is what I have to look to every morning. Every morning. Now, it's, it's hereditary, so that means it runs on both sides of my family. Usually the people in my family, usually my family members who get it, they usually get it in their 60s. I got it in my 30s. So, yeah. I've been living with it for a while. Uh, so, twice a day, I have to test my blood glucose levels. This is the meter. Ah, dang it. These are strips that I have to use the meters, and this is the Lancet. Every morning, right when I wake up, so basically when I wake up for work, ugh, when I wake up for work, I have to test this. So usually between 5.30, 5 and 5.30 in the morning. <clears throat> I'm doing this every morning. I'm on vacation right now, and it's like 8 in the morning. <laughs> I had trouble sleeping last night, but anyway, hopefully you can see what this looks like. Now, what I do is on my phone, I do have an app that helps me t helps me keep my blood glucose levels. So like yesterday, let's see if you can see it very well. Yesterday morning my blood glucose is 81, which is, eh, not the best. Actually it's really good, but it's kind of low. And in, the, in about 7.40 last night it was 115 because I ate dinner at 4. So like every time when it's like beige or yellowish, I can't tell the difference sometimes. It's like low. And say, for example, like Friday night, last Friday, when it's red, that means it's super high. As you can see, it's 233 is a high number. And the reason why it's high because I went to Subway for dinner. And I had what you'll call a pizza sub. I kind of wanted it. And usually when I go to Subway, I usually get, I usually buy a pizza sub because or a meatball sub I don't know it's it's one of the things that you do I don't know now what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna show you everything I do but if you're curious stick around if not don't worry about it catch me on the next one this should be very quick And that, and that app usually helps out a lot. And I, you know, for example, if I test three times a day for two weeks, it'll tell me what my A1C is, which is the average level of what your thing is, what blood glucose is. 107 is good. Technically, it shouldn't be less than 18. Shouldn't be less than 80. But, and this is what I do every morning. And at in two hours after dinner, sometimes, like for example, last Saturday, I couldn't test because I was I went out after dinner. I went out, hung out with some friends, so it's you know I should have waited a little bit to go out. 
or if I'm out and about and I don't test, I was like, okay, if I get it, not gonna do it, or I'll do it when I get back, or who knows. <clears throat> but between that, having some kind of a sensible, even if my diet is really good, sometimes numbers go off crazy. Like for example, if you're sick, your numbers could be jumpy. Uh, uh, if you're sick. For example, when I had staph infection, for a year my blood glucose level was off the walls crazy. And um, it took me uh, like almost two years to get it back to normal. And that's probably one of the downfalls of, what I'm go of my health, what's going on. Am I healthy? So to speak, yes. Am I going to die? No. <laughs> well, we all die, but you know, you know what I mean. And hopefully that fine. Hopefully that's a very quick video to show you what I do on a day-to-day -day basis. And um, believe me, this is something that's manageable. I've been managing it for 15 years or 16 years. I can't remember. And um, sometimes I like to show you basically what I do a part of my life instead of my hobbies. This is what I do on a daily basis helps humanize me in a way but other than that thanks very much for watching if you have any comments let, let them down below <coughs> uh, I hate early morning especially with my allergies and with that being said today I have a, to go to my um, podiatrist which is the foot the, the better known as the foot doctor and they check out my feet because you've one of those kind of things so with that being said, thanks very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and uh, share this video if you like. Alright, talk to you later.